Max Homa on the tee now. Ranked eighth in par five scoring average. So if any of these guys were to make a, a birdie on this hole, I would put my money on Max. Nicely done. Homa second shot into two. It's, it's not going to get firm enough this week. Swing, Max. Oh, I think he likes it. Yep. That was very pure right there. It's a Callum Terran type week. You know, that, that type of guy is, needs to step up. Like we were speaking of earlier. And Homa gets to one under through two. Yeah, I like that. That tells me he's going to be aiming it left. Trying to get the fade back, but this one's double crossed. Oh, lordy. And again, you got to keep it low above the grass, but below the tree limb. He, he scold that. Here's the third for Max Homa. Did he? Oh! <laughs> Almost. Max Homa now trying to wiggle this one in. It's a heck of a save. Should be close. Yeah, yeah, that's two going. in a row. That's yeah. going to end up just fine. That's two in a row where he's trying to slide it from left to right. And Fantastic shot. Try and climb back to one under. Club that's impro that's improved dramatically for Max this season. Thanks. Perfect position. Ah, that left the lighted one. Lighted one. Good job. That Jason Day does, but there's something about that move that's really appealing to me. It, it keep, takes the left side out of play as we watch Homa. Only 2:45 to the front edge. He's bailing out to the right here. Yeah, it looked like he was hitting a three wood there. I think that was kind of a lot of club for him. I thought he might use his more lofted fairway metal. And it'll trickle down there. Wow, he caught a lot of sand there. Using that down slope. Making just over two thirds of these. Nicely done. Good pace. Max starting it down the right side of the fairway on a similar line to Ricky's. Making five or six. This one definitely not short. Oh, great shot. Yeah, smartly using the slope behind. And he's going to give Ricky a read on nearly the exact same line. Or to avoid compounding mistakes. So Max Homa now, nine feet for birdie. <laughs> Tracing technology provided by TrackMan. Two yards, dirty dog. Oh, no. Homa needs some magic here. <laughs> wow. That is unbelievably good. High risk shot, ball below his feet, going for the big high one. 
It is early, but it's great to see Fowler playing well. Homa to get to minus four. There you go. What a three that was. That up and down for Homa was as good as Ricky Fowler's too. These guys are definitely feeding off each other out here today. There's good vibes, good energy. They look like they're having fun out here. Terrific tee shot there from Homer. Three yards closer, 177, a, Jay. Yeah, this is really just a, a gimme hole location, Ewan. Yeah, it is. Very, very straightforward. This is an excellent looking shot. That's what we expect right there. I'm surprised there weren't two of them out of the three. Homa hasn't exactly holed a lot either. Thus far, only 57 putts, feet of putts. This would be the longest by far. And really, quite dark. Visibility's a little bit of an issue from 300 yards away. 2012 Wells Fargo champion from Marietta, California, Ricky Fowler. This is a risky play in a downpour. All that trouble up there around the green. Well, he striped it. Wow, what a shot. In any conditions. Now you've got 12, maybe 13 feet for Eagle. What a golf shot that was. Just outside the right lip, up the hill. <laughs> Nothing to it. Well, this started in the middle of the bunker and is fading right to it. Oh, look at this one. Look at this one. Slow down. Just slow down. Slow down. Pretty not top notch. That's such a narrow green. Well, he made it back at 10. This one needs to stretch though. Little tap in for birdie three for home. Gonna get five under. Nicely done. Well, shelf or corner pretty well protected back there. Max is going right at it, though. Good shot. Really good. <laughs> it's just a little slower on bent grass, whereas everything straightens up on Bermuda. Well, Homa figured him out. <laughs> yeah, they may be able to get it over the creek in two. Go, Max. Go on, Max. Beautiful, Max. Sweet. Ooh, I'll say. Fifty four from one twenty three and drive it in. Yeah, he's done just that. Mm -hmm. Go on, dude. That's why he's the CEO. <laughs> His name's on the bag. <laughs> but the good news is, is that the light, uh, the rain is lightening up a little bit. And better news, Max Homer makes birdie. And moves to six under. Go on. Yeah, this is just a little straight bullet. Yeah, I mean, the apex on that. 55 feet. Well, you and even with these preferred lies in place, the ball kind of splashing at impact now. Yeah, it's not easy to make crisp contact. Looked like Max might have caught that a little thin, but it's on a decent line. Great shot. <laughs> that was a pretty good putter in his own right. Yeah, there's another birdie. Home at a six under. There's a single thing going on out here that I can't do. And probably 
probably going to need to get a bigger trophy case before it's all said and done. Just 90 yards, though, and he's been awfully good with the little clubs today. And good once again, Johnny. Homa pops that one in. Now back on the tee at five with Max Homa, who's suddenly a co-leader. Also less than driver. This one kind of squirting up the right-hand side. Should be okay. Might need a bounce. And you got to be careful that those flyers coming out of this from 102. This looks well controlled. Oh, he's going to love that. What a shot from Max Homa. Max Homa having a putt here to get a two-shot lead. Not much to this. You would never have bet on that. On the fifth green, Max Homa walking to 16, now has a two-shot cushion. That's up the left half as well, Ian. They need to get down. Wow, Donnie, they, they both stayed in the fairway. They're about 40 yards short. Now, Max. Here you come, down the hill. Fantastic shot there from Max Homer. Wipe the moisture off your putter face always. Always remember that at home. Give your putter face a wipe when the conditions are wet, because if you've got some sand on the face, it makes a big difference to the contact. On this back in 2019, Quell Hollow, and only Rory McElroy is a multiple champ of this event. That means he's turning it with the wind. Yep, he's trying to use the wind, bringing it in off the right. A little club twirl. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Great shot from Max. You tell he loved it from the start, should have. Set up a birdie opportunity, and they've been few and far between at that opening hole. Homa for birdie at one. Slightly different line. More up the hill, a little left to right. What a start. Fans out there cheering for him. You heard him on the opening tee. You're going to love that. Within one of Keegan Bradley. At the Wells Fargo Championship on a chilly Sunday outside the nation's capital. That's Max Homa on the tee at five. Good ball. Let's go, baby. Okay, smooth swing there. He's been working on this part of his game with Mac, uh, Mark Blackburn a lot, trying to get a bit more shallow coming in. That way he can control the trajectory and spin better. Ooh, fortunate break of yes. the shoulder. Luck is the residue of hard work, Terry. Five, and Terry Max Homa is the leader by two. That's the same club that Keegan chose, seven iron. Yeah, she's good at that little chippy sub swing. Yeah, oh, really good. Really. Some major style points there, Nick. Oh, what a two. To join Bradley at eight under par. Hey, pal. Pal. We were live there with Max Homer. They're using the bottom tee at par five today. With a good tee shot sitting up this hole. That was seven wood. Oh, yeah. Just let it trickle out. Yeah, well played. 
would have just focused on the landing spot. Tremendous shot. Kind of little low fade. Yeah, okay, no got what he wanted. Back to 15 in Homa. That's another eight iron. Can he take advantage? Yeah, Walking after it, Donnie. Oh. Oh. Nice. Money and hit an iron way to the left. And potential two shot swing here. This was Homa for birdie. He goes to nine under. Oh, that was big. Might be tough to make birdie from there. Bradley may need to. But the ball was inside. Oh, it was on the very oh, right edge of the front. Perfect. Did you not see it? No, I could see Look it. Look at that. I thought he would after seeing it hit that grass. This was the second for Homer. Just needs to find the green. How about the rhythm and tempo of that swing right there? Nothing rushed. No fear of it running away. It's just get it there. It's two, two putts to win. What a good putt. That's all that's left for his third win since the beginning of 2021. Champion on the rise. Max Homa. Good job, Good job, Good job. Good job. Good job. Thanks for watching the PGA Tour on YouTube. To watch another video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.